Hello again, everybody. It's the Reverend Jay Goldstein, and welcome to another episode of Activities. And today's activity should be extra exciting because we're taking a road trip with Motor Racing Magnetic Travel Game. And when I say road trip, I mean it. We're going to go uptown to my friend Theo's studio and play this game with him. Hopefully when we're done playing, we'll still be friends. Um, it's a pretty boring box, so not a lot to say. Although there is a pretty, there's the choking hazard warning. There is a pretty interesting warning. Because there are magnetic pieces in here, I have been warned that if I swallow them, they could stick together inside me and cause more damage than I expect. Well, I'll keep that in mind as we go, as we go uptown to my friend Theo's place to play a game of motor racing, magnetic travel game. Let's go! Hey, so we're back and we're now midtown at my friend Theo's studio. And Theo, this, this is the game I told you about. Ooh. Motor racing, Motor magnetic, racing. <laughs> magnetic travel game, and so what makes it magnet, magnetic. Oh, because it's got magnets. It's got magnets in it. That's <laughs> what makes it magnetic. In fact, we've been warned by the box that if you swallow the pieces, they could potentially. That's that's Theo's foot, making its first of probably many appearances. <laughs> in videos of mine, uh, but it's warned that if you swallow the pieces, not only can you choke, but they can actually cling together magnetically Whoa. and cause a bigger problem <laughs> than Is you. Is that like a warning? That's the warning? That's an actual warning right here on the <laughs> box. But that's pretty much all you get on the box. They didn't tell us much about it, so I've been saving opening the box till now. We know that there's one game in it, it's from China, and it was $1.50, so uh, this is it. Ready? Now I'm I'm imagining Bring it on. that there's like a deck of cards and some pieces and, and a roadway. What do you think's in there? Um, Remember, it's magnetic travel. It's probably like an eight cylinder with like uh, uh, some hot racing stripes on it. You're, so you're guessing an actual car. Yeah. All right. I, mean, I hope you're right. I hope there's like an actual car in this tiny <laughs> box. Let's see. We take it out and aha! Whoa. And we open this up, and it's got one of those neat little locky things. Oh, right? wow. It's actually so it's, like a... Uh, so this is where all the pieces are going to be inside here. And here are all the pieces. I want... This is them. So it's just a die to roll on. And the pieces. And the pieces, and you go around this, this track that doesn't even sit down uh, flat. I get it. So I mean, It'd be cool I, if they move on their own, but you got to move them yourself. It seems. Where do you think they got a plastic baggie this small? What could this? I mean, what are they? I guess jewelry, right? No drugs, basically. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh, that's right. Breaking Bad. They had that. That's right. I saw <laughs> yeah, that. They don't only make those bags for a sure. yeah, certain. They, they make them in a Jewel, jewelry in parentheses. So I was gonna say let's play this game, but I'm really not all that excited, excited about this game because all it is is all you could do instead of this is just roll the die and add up your numbers right until you got to the number you wanted well, your piece isn't going anywhere because it's magnetic, it's magnetic. <laughs> well they, here's the other problem is as they're racing by each other they stick to each they're going to stick to each other I think. Well, and that's maybe. when you don't want to swallow them. And you, do <laughs> <laughs> you especially don't want to swallow them while they're already on the board. <laughs> but that's it. That's the uh, motor racing magnet. You want to give it a spin? See what it's like to take. A oh, I listen. You got a three. It's right. Three. That's out there. <laughs> so what's it like driving around the uh, the track there? Give a, give a little review about the handling. Um, that was. Good handling. Definitely, uh, responsive? Responsive. Do you like the rack and peanut steering? The <laughs> rack and peanut? The rack and peanut <laughs> steering? Yes, I do. Very much so. Well, thank you very much, my friend Theo, and I thank you so much for having us over at your studio today anytime, to, anytime. to investigate this game. Thank you. I'm going to take you up on that. 
And, and thank you, Theos. <laughs> if you like this video for some reason, please hit the like button. If I you're, did. If you uh, if, share this with somebody you like, or if you hated it, share it with somebody you dislike. <laughs> you can subscribe to it. There's a button down there. It just says subscribe. If you've already subscribed, don't hit that button. It'll unsubscribe you, and you won't get to uh, see what else comes on. And we learned something today about games and baggies and everything. So until next time, uh, for my friend Theo mm -hmm. at his studio, uh, this is Reverend Jay Goldstein. See you next time. Bye. <laughs>